Hi everyone. Uh, it's been a while since I've done a video of me being outside, uh, you know, dr driving. Uh, so what I'm going to do, uh, today is Tuesday and it's Seniors Day at Value Village. And that's where they sell, you know, stuff that people bring in. So there's uh, used CDs and vinyl and clothes and all kinds of stuff. And a few months ago, Molly and I were at Value Village and she saw this T-Fall griller, gr grill, griller. And it was $20 and it looked brand new. And I have used it making wraps and whatever for probably over a hundred times since I've, since I've bought it. So uh, there are really, you know, sometimes good deals there. I also am, I'm looking for a inexpensive, uh, stereo amplifier. I do have my brother-in-law's amplifier. I think it's a Yamaha. But when I use the headphones, for some reason it cuts out I, once in a while. It's really annoying. I was thinking it was my my headphone, you know, the line for my headphone. But it works fine, you know, on my little CD player. So I think it's his amp. Just the headphone jack isn't working that, that well. So I might try and buy, you know, like a $20 amp or something. Uh, yeah, you can get some really good deals for stereo equipment there and everything else. And uh, so let's go to Belleville, Ontario and Value Village. So uh, Belleville, Ontario is about 10 miles from Trenton. a much bigger city than Trenton. So I made a, I made a kind of a mistake this morning. As you know, I'm on, well, as some of you know, I'm on my Bootrans patch at the highest level. And I'm also on Naprox 500 milligrams, which I take two times a day in the morning and then know around dinner time with food and for some reason this morning I took it you know the the, the naproxen uh, around 7 in the morning and then a couple of hours later I, I take a Tylenol extra strength and you know sometimes you're just not thinking them <laughs> you're kind of uh, out of it I guess I took another naprox so that was kind of scary. I did talk to my, I had to pick up another uh, Blue Trans patch this morning for $45. And uh, so I talked to the pharmacist and he says I should be okay. You know, he asked if I was, I was on blood thinners or whatever and I'm not. And I feel okay. I actually feel in less pain than usual. <laughs> but, you know, it is scary. And so I just have to remember not to do that again. And I am, you know, when I, whenever I take my, my naproxen or I take Tylenol, I always write it down. So I, I'm making sure I'm not taking too much of it. And I just put my winter tires on. I know uh, for years and years I used to have the all seasons. And then when I was in a pretty bad uh, car accident on the highway, hit black ice. Not that black ice is going to prevent <laughs> if you have winter tires on, but that just kind of scared me to, you know, for the winter driving to be as safe as possible. So I've had, I just put on my winter tires a couple days ago. Being prepared for winter. Driving in the winter in Ontario is not always fun. Thankfully, you know, I no longer have to work. And uh, so if it's, you know, bad out, I'm not going to be driving in them. It's a very nice day, but it's chilly.
So our speed limit, as you can see, you can see a sign that says 60. So that's 60 kilometers per hour. But in my car, it also has the miles per hour. So that's about, what, I guess, 40, 40 miles per hour. And our highways are 100 kilometers per hour, although most people go at least 110. I go up, to, you know, up to 120. But anything past that, forget it. I mean, if you're going 100 kilometers an hour on the highway, everybody's going to be passing you. So 100 kilometers is 60 miles per hour. Look at states. There's McKesson that I used to work at. I just wanted to add that uh, there are a uh, couple of employees at Value Village that I guess watch my videos, at least my, you know, on my main channel, Canadian Stuff Off. And uh, I was, you know, they came up and talked to me and said hello. So that's always nice. It, uh, you know, once in a while I'd be, somebody would say hello to me and I watch your videos blah 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 but you know with when we were wearing masks and all of the COVID <laughs> nightmare that we went through nobody recognized me because I was wearing a mask <laughs>
we there yet? Yes, we are. Just around this corner. So I just got back from Value Village and I got a couple of pretty good deals. I'm very happy. First up, I bought a used amplifier for $14.99 and 30% off that because it's Seniors Day. There are bonuses to being old. And so hopefully, and it's got, I made sure it has a headphone jack and then I can hook up my CD player for a better sound than, you know, what I use for my portable CD player. We'll see. San Sansui. Integrated Stereo Amplifier. Just needs a bit of a cleaning. And this is my computer chair I've had uh, for probably at least 10 years and it's kind of <laughs> wearing down and it's not that comfortable. I did buy this one a few months back and Molly uses it when she's here but I find it, it it's way too uncomfortable for me and I thought it I thought it looked comfortable but nope and uh, it also it doesn't it either doesn't raise up enough or it doesn't, I th yeah, I don't think it lowers enough, which is stupid. But look what I saw at Value Village. In very good condition, a computer chair. Very comfortable, I sat in it. And there's only this little bit of, you know, whatever there, that's nothing. And I bought it for $20.99 plus 30% off because I'm a senior. Yeah. Yeah, much better padding than either of the other. Now I have three computer chairs. <laughs> but yeah, I'm very happy. So, thank you for watching my adventure going to Value Village in Belleville, Ontario. Please remember to leave a thumbs up and a comment below. I'd really appreciate it. Bye.